I think we are a, a different dental practice. We are small, we are bespoke. The patient is at the centre of the practice. It's often commented by patients that they're always greeted warmly, welcomed into the practice, made to feel very welcome here. Many new patients to the practice comment that they're very pleased with their choice, that they were nervous about making the first move to come to a dentist after a, an absence of seeing a, a dentist for a number of years. I was recommended um, to Ian's surgery by a friend who's been coming to see him and um, I decided to give it a gamble and I've been coming here ever since. He's very professional, helpful, answers all my questions, makes me feel at ease. It's quite easy to put many patients at ease, which is to listen to their concerns, to act upon those concerns, make sure that they are heard, not just listened to, and that any concerns that they have are properly addressed. Ian's just great, he doesn't, he tells you this, what's going on, and he doesn't make you panic. And I've been so like happy with him that I've been asked three of my friends to kind of come and try him out. I've been in this game for nearly 25 years now. I started my career in the hospital service doing uh, postgraduate work, oral surgery, advanced restorative work. But then I moved into the community dental service, looking after patients with complex medical histories. If a patient comes to me with a medical history which is somewhat complex, perhaps they're on anticoagulant therapy, on multiple medications, then there is a jolly good chance that I can treat the patient safely within the practice rather than referring them out. I am particularly happy with the membership plan that we've developed at Salisbury House. For a small, regular, monthly fee, patients can come in for their six monthly checkup and hygiene visit and not pay a single penny more. This is guaranteed to be less than had the patient paid pay as you go. I started coming and was shocked at how different it was from my old practice and then that was modern and fancy and computers and things like that. When I bought the practice I did make a decision to upgrade the equipment quite significantly and instead of just bringing it up to date I've taken much of the equipment that we have beyond what many practices have. We have digital x-ray for example. You can take an x-ray and literally 20 seconds later it's on the screen. We don't have to deal with nasty chemicals, we don't have to wait 10 minutes for the x-ray to come through. When I'm working with specialists, we can email these x-rays digitally instead of having to send copies in the post. I just like the way he explains if there's a problem or why something's happening with my teeth. We've also invested in an intraoral camera, a pen-like camera which is inserted into a patient's mouth and which can take a very high quality picture of for example, a cracked tooth or a broken filling. So the days when you just have to take my word for it that you need it, a filling or a crown and why are over. I'm pleased. My teeth were absolutely terrible before I started coming here and I think, believe now, it's quite nice and white. <laughs>